Hi everyone and welcome back to our blog. I am James Cuervo, your senior instructor here at Digital Drafting Systems. Today's topic is using the new Revit 2021.1 Insert Autodesk Family Dialog Box. Now, as a qualifier, I have to mention that it is a cloud service and for it to work, you must have a working internet access and an active subscription. Very well, let's get started. If you go to the Insert panel, uh, tab rather, and then you go to the Load from Library panel, you'll see Load Autodesk Family. This will automatically open up the web location, and then here you'll have a couple of items. In this particular case, I've got this window setting, which is the filter. I can reset the filter so I can then see all of the categories here in the browser section. If I want to select a specific one, once again, I can come here and select the specific one that I would like to see, let's say for example doors, okay, and this will automatically show me all of the doors that are available. Now, if I want to go back and see the listing, if I open this, you'll notice that it's the filter set, so uh, what I need to do, as I did before, was reset the filter and then it allows me to navigate through here. If I want to use the browser, then I can select doors once again, and this will allow me to select all the doors that are available or anything that has to do with doors, including some of the uh, door hardware. If I want to sign, uh, search for something specifically, I can type in doors here in the search bar, hit the enter key, and it will load all of the doors that are on the web. Let's give it a couple of seconds because it's actually looking for all of the door items that are on the web. And here you'll see, not only does it show you the doors that are available, okay, but it also shows you two-dimensional details, and it shows you some cabinets that have some doors on it. Anything that is relevant to doors or has the door word in its name. If I need to see this blank again, I need to then remove all of that, and this allows me to see all of the items that are here on the browser. Now, following this, if this little icon here is the local settings, in which case I know that I'm using the language English, which I can then switch. And I'm using the region United States Imperial. I can switch it back and forth. Tuning it on. This button here allows me to then go ahead and see it as a list here or as a slideshow here. Let's go back to doors here. And if I need to insert an item from here, I just select the door that I want and say load. Once I do that, I select the one that I want. Let's say, for example, this one here and say open. At which case, then when I come over here to inserts, an in architecture rather, I go to doors. That door is now set as the, lo the most current one and it's just a matter of placing it. With that, we have seen now how easy it is to use the new Load Autodesk Family Dialog Box. I am James Cuervo with Digital Drafting Systems, wishing you a safe day. Thank you for watching.